this video we are going to discuss about tables in sap fico in sap a table is a structured data storage object in the sap database that holds business and configuration data the data stores in transaction data master data customizing or configuration data in database we have many tables in sap but we are discussing the major uh, use of daily usage in sap fico first table bkp this is accounting document header data in this uh, data it stores header level data for accounting documents the key fields like these are the technical names for document number bill number for company code be ucrs physically year gjhr document type blart so how to find this uh, tables in sap let's go to sap for example f-02 you can check the company code click on function f1 click here technical information you are able to see the the table name here like bkpf okay the date of uh, element you can see or field name you can see here like bukrs okay you can see here the screen field bkpf bukrs okay means the, in the bkpf table this screen field name is bukrs the company code okay? that is a technical name okay it used to join with bsec means accounting uh, document line items and ac doca used in like fb03 fb50 f-0, there are many transactions so this is the major use of bkpf table majorly it used for line item report purpose and g report purpose will use okay how to open this tables in sap like if you go to sc16n sorry sc16n from here we can access these tables like t001 here company code data we have normally if you execute you are able to see the whole company codes how many company codes available in this system You can see the number of hits we have 179 company codes so another transaction is like sc11 here you can see this the table you can click if you click on display you are able to see same with the technical name the whatever the table data have we can see from here okay you can see the length of the fields also from sc11 bsec is a accounting document segment it's a line item data normally stores in this is stores in line item level okay gl vendor customer okay all data will available in the bsec this is a big table in the sap it is used in custom extraction and fi reporting generation purpose we will use this bsec if you go to sap if you give the bsec table data here if you want to see the for example any thousand company code how many documents if you give the specific document you are able to see the data i will execute this so you are able to see the year wise for example 2005 we have what accounting entries we are able to see the from this table majorly we will use this type uh, these tables in the custom reporting purpose ac doca table is a universal general entry line item this is a universal table this is available in s4 hana only not in ecc versions the use is centralized line item table introduced in s4 hana okay it merges 
EKPF and FIB sec and C wall and atom and ML and acetylcholine to one source of truth. This is a single source of truth. And for this, no need to reconcile across the modules. We can able to access the data from all modules. Okay. This table used for real time reporting purpose. Serious use in a margin analysis purpose. In S4 HANA, we will use this table regularly. BS ID and BS ID. BS ID is a open item customer related table and BS ID for cleared items for customers. You are able to see them from this BS ID from open items, BS ID from cleared items. You can see the use open items and the cleared items. This is normally using for AR reporting purpose like cash up uh, applications or log boxes you can use uh, these tables while creating any custom reports you need to know uh, from which table has which data then only you are able to do that custom enhancements like bsik and bsik bsik data stores like open item details of vendors and bsik it is a cleared item of details of vendors okay vendor account balance you can see uh, when uh, while automatic uh, program while executing uh, we need open item details then you can check the details from bsik lfb1 knb1 this lfb1 is a vendor company code data we have knb1 is, means uh, Sorry, LF, LFB1 means vendor com, uh, company code data, KNB1 means customer company code data. We, we In this data, the data will store. Okay, these are the company code specific data. Like we can see from this table payment terms and reconciliation accounts, everything. Two more tables also we have like LFA1 and KNA1. That's the general data of vendor and customer details. Fagalflexa and Fagalflexa T. Fagalflexa is used for actual line items in new GL. Okay. Fagalflexa T is uh, total table details we have. Relevant in S4 HANA for backward compatibility. Okay. SKA1, SKB1. SKA1 is related to chart of accounts like um, GL master data. We The data stores in GL master. SKB1 company code level uh, GL master data it is it is stores it used in GL configuration and reporting filters ledger resume and current, uh, currency and controls we can you uh, we can see the data from these two tables CSKS and CSKT these tab, uh, tables used for the cost center uh, data so CSKS, uh, CSKS you can check from the cost center related information and this is you can see from the CSKT this is a description of the cost centers it used in CO postings and cost center planning and reporting purpose we can use this table ANLA, ANLB, ANLC this is asset master data values you can see this ANLA used for general asset master NLB used for depreciation areas, NLC for asset value fields. This used in asset acquisitions and retirements and depreciation purpose. We can use these tables. In S4 HANA, these are available in AC DOCA. In T030 table, what is uh, automatic account determination table? This normally integration purpose. This uh, integration details we will have in this table. Controls the GL account mapping from MMSD and asset account integration. You can see OBYC, VKOA. From this, uh, very easy used. In this uh, T codes, where the account in determination details will have in this table. Okay. Take this exchange rate table. In this uh, data, normally used for stores daily exchange rate. In this uh, table, daily. Uh, Business will upload the daily exchange rates from in this table. It is used in uh, foreign currency valuations, currency translations, uh, and consolidation purpose. We use these tables. Okay.
record table REGUH. The payment document header details. The stores payment run headers executed via F110. If you executed F110, the details will store in a REGUH table. You are able to see the uh, while giving the paying company code details, you can able to see what is the uh, which date and what is the identification number you can check from there and any IDOC is uh, processed then also you can check from the IDOC IDOC details from the is table okay in this uh, table the payment header details will have whereas reg up payment line items here we can store the data like line item details hold the line item details for the payment run you can see the key fields like Bella, Lifnar, GJHR, JLLS, CH means Bellnar means document vendor, Lifnar means custom. Sorry, vendor and this is GJHR means physical year. This is the payment method. These are the technical names. PAYR payment medium table. This is used for captured data used in generated DME means the bank file like XML NT103 fields like JetBank Receipt Bank and Payment Method and Check Numbers by giving these fields you can able to see the data in the PAYR table okay Hem, sorry P042Z the bank this table used for maps company codes to house bank and accounts for APP you can check the bank details from this table bank determination how the mapping to the company code now this is a dunning related uh, table so if you executed dunning the dunning notice header details stores in in this mhnk table in mhnd table the dunning notice line items line item details will store in a mhnd table okay Whereas FEBCO, the bank statement header details, it stores the importer statement metadata like bank account, bank, come account and date. The statement details, these are the key fields you can check. This is used under FF underscore 5 while uploading the statement, the header data stores here. Okay. And FEBP, the bank statement line items. In this table, thus line item data like debit and credit line items are stores in this table. T0 table key house bank and account data in this uh, table house bank details all account data will store okay and BSIS and BSS BSIS means GL account is an open item GL accounts data will uh, available in this table this is used for normal reporting purpose we can check from here and BSIS is the cleared uh, line item uh, for GL accounts the data store clear the GLI items details okay thank you